Here, take one down, pass it around. 43 bottles of beer in the wall. 43 bottles of beer in the wall. 43 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it about. 42 bottles of beer in the wall. 42 bottles of beer in the wall. 42 bottles of beer in the wall. 41 bottles of beer in the wall. 41 bottles of beer. 41 bottles of beer. 41 bottles of beer. 41 bottles of beer. Ninety-nine bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-nine bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. Ninety-eight bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 97 bottles of beer on the wall. 97 bottles of beer on the wall. 97 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. Three stories underground, an abandoned facility in the middle of nowhere. You could scream as loud as you wanted to and there wouldn't be a soul who could hear you for miles. Now you're asking yourself, then why the gag? Simply because I have a very large aversion to loud noises. So, if I remove that gag and you start screaming, simply going to put it back again. Do we understand each other? Good. Mm, careful. There we go. I'm really sorry. I know. I love Carla. Did Carl ever tell you what I do for a living? You, you teach science. Close. Chemistry professor. Did you ever pay attention to chemistry class, Jack? Uh, hey, do you know what this is? A uh, pipette. Close. Mm -hmm. It's a burette. A volumetric pipette is used to measure the precise amount each time. Now, a burette, on the other hand, allows you much more freedom. <laughs> what are you going to do to me? This is your driving foot, correct? Well, Jack, I'm going to ensure that you never hurt anyone the way that you've hurt me. How did you know? 
Facebook, quite a remarkable thing. Fake email, fake profile, a few photos. Send an invite, the next thing you know, we're friends. You don't love her. Hmm. Don't pretend like she needs anything of you. Do you know how much you hurt her? Carla once asked me why I never wanted children. I told her because there's too many ways that a child can grow up wrong. It's a risk I wasn't willing to take. That doesn't make me love her any less. If you loved her so much, why didn't you fight for her? Shut up! Why do you know? It is precisely because I loved her as much as I did that I let her go! Oh, my apologies, I lost my um, <clears throat> composure. Don't give me that bullshit. She told me what you said. I had a very difficult childhood. Um, my life consisted of schoolwork, chores, making ends meet, the occasional beating. I was the top of my class the entire time, but I was not allowed time for family, friends, connections. It is a fate that I wouldn't even wish upon you, much less Carla. She loved me. She wouldn't want you to do this. You're... You're probably right. But we'll never know. Because you took her from me. I tried to explain to her so many times, but the words... She stopped talking to me. No, I'll never get to explain to her why I said the things that I said. You took that from me. Take one down, pass it around. 98 bottles of beer on the wall. Whoa, whoa, watch out! the only thing you've ever loved. I know I deserve whatever you do to me, but hurting me isn't going to bring her back. Don't worry. This won't hurt at all. For right now. I have problem with loud noises, remember? The last post of Carla on Facebook was from you. Tormenting Carla by singing 99 bottles of beer on the wall, all the way to zero, while she's trapped in the car with me, nowhere to run. <laughs> Tormenting. Trapped. Nowhere to run. Sound familiar? Since she spent her last few moments listening to that insipid song, I am going to fill this burette with hydrofluoric acid and slowly drip it into this bucket containing your foot until you are done singing the song. You are crazy. Oh, that very well may be, but it doesn't improve your predicament one bit. You know, I like it, Jack. I'm gonna give you a little head start. You can go ahead and start singing now. You're messing with me, right? This, 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 this is just water, this is not real. Ninety-nine bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-nine bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Ninety-eight bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Ninety-seven bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-seven bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-seven bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Ninety-six bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-six bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety-six bottles of beer. Take one down. Pass it around. Ninety-five bottles of beer. Chemistry 101, Jack. The fluoride is so electronegative that it actually breaks down the oxygen bonds in glass. So it's all plasticware today. Did you watch Breaking Bad? They covered this. 
Jack, the movies get it wrong all the time. You don't need a strong acid that sizzles and smokes to do permanent damage. I mean, take hydrofluoric acid, for example. It looks like water, but it's extraordinary corrosive. Scientists consider it a weak acid, as a matter of fact. It never fully ionizes in a diluted solution, so it doesn't even have to be concentrated to uh, eat through flesh. The good news is, is that it interferes with your nerve function, so you actually won't feel that it's eating through your flesh for quite some time, which also does me the great privilege of not having to sit through and listen to your scream. <laughs> of your body surface area to come in any contact with any concentration to induce systemic toxicity. Of course, duration of exposure is also a determining factor. So let me ask you this, Jack. How fast can you sing? down, pass it around. One bottle of beer on the wall. One bottle of beer on the wall. One bottle of beer. Take one down, pass it around. No more bottles of beer on the wall. Hooray! Wow, you went all the way to zero, didn't you? Honestly, I thought you were gonna stop me at 75, but you never did, so I kept going. Then I realized you were asleep when I got down to 10. <laughs> oh no. If, even if I was awake, I wouldn't stop you. You got yourself into this mess. You can sing your way out of it. Brutal. Babe, you okay? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I just had some disturbing dream about you and my dad. Your dad? His name is Simon. of science in Massachusetts. This is the first time you've ever talked about your dad. There's a reason for that. We're not on speaking terms. He's not family. I wondered about that. I decided not to ask because I knew you'd tell me if you wanted to. Well, first, he tried to get my mom to abort me. And when she finally left him, he didn't even ask for partial custody. You know, he even said that if he knew I would turn out the way I was, he still wouldn't ask to keep me. What the fuck? That's harsh. It's fucking ass. It's okay. I am over it. I know a good way to distract you. I hesitate to ask. Did you know the verse continues? What? No more bottles of beer on the wall. No more bottles of beer. Go to the store, buy some more, 99 bottles of beer on the wall. <laughs> Tormenting Carla by singing 99 bottles of beer on the wall all the way down to zero while she's trapped in the car with me, comma. Nowhere to run, period. About to start the song over again, comma. Wish your luck, exclamation point. 99 bottles of beer on the what? wall, 99 what? bottles of beer. What did you just beer. post on Facebook? Take one down, pass it around, 98 bottles of beer on the wall. No, watch out! Ah!